do you minuscule sky dwellers find such power? Dragons, I think. Mostly. Hey, look. The gateway's closing. Like three different kinds of dragons. We're not done yet. All right. Relink gamers. We're here. Everything in the game, once again, is telling me that this seems to be the final boss fight of the story. Now, last time I thought that, I got absolutely debated. But, like, at a certain point, you can only do so many, you know, you can only do so many fake-outs before it starts getting a little ridiculous. Even, Cat like, even the game, the characters, are like, Catalina's like, this looks like the final battle. Sierra's like, you're at the home stretch. We have it on our side. We fought alongside all of the other generals in the last episode. But here we are, Pillar of Vayoi, um, presumably about to face off with Lilith. The gate to the astral realm? Oh, yeah. It looks even scarier up close. Strange, isn't it? Gateways are usually a symbol of hope and new opportunity. I guess they are for someone in this case. If that door opens, well, well. the skies will fall. Yes. Let it open. Also, yes. We'll beat Lilith, mm. grab Roland, and spear at home. home. Wouldn't that be nice? Yeah, yeah. So the idea, I guess, is well, there's Angramanyu. We already see all his little Exodia hands there. Yeah, the idea is uh, we're going to probably fight Lilith, Angramanyu, hopefully free Roland, hopefully nobody has to die. Though I'm a little worried about Id making some sort of sacrifice. We'll see, we'll see. Let's hope this goes well. Hello. Oh, baby. The longer the loading screen, the more ominous the upcoming events. That's, that's the, the rule. There's Roland. Or Astraeus, as he is apparently called. Oh god. He's turning him into matter, or into energy, bro. He's equal to MC squirting him. Make it stop. This pitiful fate could have been avoided. Why must you insist on quarreling with your own brethren? It's unfathomable. Truly. I mean Gosh, he's so smug. I just want to see her uh, lose that cool for at least a second before this is all over. Ah, shaman. Impeccable timing as always, I see. Oh no. Can you feel the grip of imminent salvation? I am the hell are you talking about, man? To watch. <laughs> watch these hands. And it. Is this betrayal? You could say that, yeah. Hmm. Where did I go wrong? <laughs> Where did I go wrong? You can't sacrifice our God, what a just detestable individual. I got sun coming in for a second. This is our home. Get my curtains close. There you, you go. So I'm saying. Like, really, really just does not care about potentially ending the entire world. Oh, yeah. There's our big boy. Come on. Don't immediately just get sealed away, please. It was worth a try, right? Can't a man dream? Once I reach Estelusia, I shall guide this world to Utopia. This is cheating, man. reject my heartfelt invitation? Ah, how I pity you poor misguided creatures. Yeah, like we give a crap about anything you say. <laughs> Your messed up utopia is built on sacrifice. No way we're letting that fly. I think he said it uh, about as well as anyone else could. Options fail me. I can no longer sway your hearts or minds. I, did you really expect that that would work? Like, at all? All right. Well, I mean, you know what? As a parting gift. She doesn't mess around. May you all find solace in death's warm embrace. Wow. Okay, I need to. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get up here and close these curtains real quick once this cutscene is over. But I'll. I'll, uh, I'll cut that out. You guys will see. Will not see this pause screen for very long. Nice thing about single player games, how huh? you can just uh, pause the loop. Anyways. The same can't be said of your corrupt ambition. You love to hear it. Please don't disappoint me any further. Id, please keep disappointing her. I, it's, it's actually very important that you do. You guys like chill. There you go. Listen to me. I think you've lost sight of the big picture. Please guide us when 
I mean, couldn't you just, like, figure out another way to get back there? Like, we might even be willing to help you. Just absorb Angramanyu. Maybe we can just absorb you. Oh, there he is. Excuse me. Pardon me. I have to wait a little bit here so I don't get the, the triple roll. Alright. Any linkers? Perfect. Oh, any double linkers? No. He's a he's a he's a coward. He teleported away. Like the nerd that he is. Hello, Deva. Level 45, huh? That's not bad. We're not we're not that much lower level than him. What are these guys doing? Oh my god. Big laser. Get wrecked, nerd. Oh, perfect dodge. You love to see it. Oh, these things, yeah. And then that'll open up our wormhole to go beat up on Angramanyu, right? Yeah. Where is he? Come here. Uh, okay, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. I thought he was down immediately. I was not ready for the laser. And I realized a little bit too late that the laser was happening. My bad. Uh, but he is still, yeah, he is still hittable, which is good. Can we just swing at him? Nice, yeah. We can just keep hitting the main body like this. Oh, we're just getting, we're taking all this blight damage, though. I did not notice. Which is definitely unfortunate. Nice. I'm going to take one of these little heals for myself here. To undo all the blight. Oh my god, never mind. They didn't undo shit. I'm still, like, taking all this damage. Uh, hello? Oh, okay. Goodbye. Maybe we don't want to be in the wormhole anymore. Maybe it's a good idea to leave this realm. Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it actually would have been a good idea to leave the wormhole there so we weren't on the same realm as Angra and they couldn't uh, blow us up quite as hard. Um, this is, this is tough. This is, this is a tough one. Okay, I suppose we can just stay behind the hands, right? Yeah, and theoretically we'll be, we'll be safe and sound for the most part. Nice. Feels nice. Uh, what, are, what is last judgment? Uh, do we have to blow up these hands? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we do. Very much so. Okay. Don't mind me. That is a one shot. That's good. I think this might still not be optimal. No, okay, we do need it. Yeah. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. We all need to break all of them. I was like, I don't think I have enough in the tank to get rid of all of these in time. Luckily, I did not have to. Are you gonna get up? Let me let me do this. Wonderful. And now we'll do a quick one for the third. Wonderful. It, it, it uh, you know he's he's got the right mindset. I love to see it. Uh, what? Are you still down? Where's your where's your little guy? I want to punch your little guy right in his stupid mouth so I can meet you face to face on the field of a battle, in the marketplace of ideas, even. Bonk. Uh, where where's the little guy? Any little guy killers? There's the little guy. There you go. Thank you, it. Wormhole it is. Where is it? There he is. Oh, and he's actually- yeah, that- see, this time he's actually down. That's why I got debated previously. I guess if we, uh, go debuff immunity, we won't have to worry about this, right? Yeah, we, we can't get blighted anymore. And we can just kind of freely bonk him on the head. Yeah, I don't see why not. This seems like a this seems like a great strategy. Next time Angra pops up, I'm going to skybound dart his ass. This gonna work? Yes, wonderful. I just wanna whatever he was gonna do, I want to not let him do it. I want to get him locked in this cutscene here while we can just hopefully uh, bang away at him. Perfect. Yeah, I mean this is definitely like phase one or whatever, but now at least phase one's over. Do we have to wait? I think we have to wait for the full burst for this to actually end. Skybound darts like this never actually finish them off until the full burst. Yeah, there you go. Wunderbar. Great. All right, what's next? Because we, I mean, it can't be that easy, right? But maybe Roland's free at least? He can help us with whatever comes next? Yes. That's a funny sound he made as he was falling. Dragons, I think? Mostly? 
Hey, look, the gateway's closing. Like three different kinds of dragons. I'm sorry to preclude celebrations, but mm -hmm. we're not done yet. As you like. As, uh, to be fair, again, I didn't quite expect. Oh god, he's gonna use herself for the gateway? Can, can we just... Can we not? She's attempting a fusion. Can this like backfire horribly and kill her or something? Wait, she will? I guess she'll become a primal beast this way, technically? It's like, uh, I don't know. He miscalculated somewhere? You know, she just messes up. Rips her in half, you know, because... Take this vessel! I am yours! Okay, well... Of course, we have to fight her fused with the final boss. Something terrible is coming. You don't say. It's okay, she's not an astral anymore. That means she's weaker, right? That's, that's how that works, I thought. Oh man, she is... Uh, you look weird. I, I I don't think you want to see what you look like. Oh, she's gone. She's gone completely off the deep end. Good to know. Uh, oh, okay. Any healers? We got a mortal pain back, so that's good. Uh, well, I guess we're doing this now. I don't want to be at one HP, but oh well. Bonk. Okay, yeah. There you go, some heals. Perfect. Oh, yeah, we got, like, HP regen or something in next time. What? Oh, my God. I did not notice. Okay. Well. We can't hit these things, can we? Yeah. I guess we just have to focus on these guys for a little bit here, but... I'm gathering ground. I don't want to waste immortal pain to get immune immunity to the blight, right? Oh my god. Maybe I should have though. Wait, no, guys! Don't leave me! Oh god! Wait, wait, I'm coming, I'm coming! Just, I gotta mash some buttons real quick. I don't want to use the revival potion. You gotta believe me. Basaraga, come on! Come on, buddy! Yeah, yeah! I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It was a really unfortunate time to go down. You gotta believe me. I was not. It was not intentional. Oh, man. Okay, what the hell's going on? Is Roland just going to uh, Holy Nova all of these guys out of here? That's the hope. Okay. Well, this is holding for now. Is this like your version of Netherrath, maybe? Is this like a... Oh, God. What in... The huh? Oh my god, it's it's actually endgame. All of the boys. Oh! Yeah, well that sounds like... That explains it. That's on me, I was like, Zaspa, what's your plan here? What are you gonna do? Clearly, I made a big mistake underestimating him. Him and Histi, as it were. Did you could just do that? You might need your ship, unless you plan on walking home. Why, thank you. Oh, boy. Okay, 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 okay. Winnable, winnable, guys, winnable. The cavalry has arrived. Still lots to do, though. That sure is still a lot of guys. Oh, and we got Magliel. Where's Galanta? Show me my boy. I must, I must be shown my boy. Or is he, uh, is he still asleep? Come on, man. Surely your nap is over by now. It's been, like, an hour. I mean, to be fair, I'm, I'm usually more of an hour and a half napper, but... There he is! My, my, my Tadakatsu Honda, uh, Lubu-looking boy. Wonderful. Look at all this. Everyone has turned against you, Lilith. Hope you're happy. Look at how you've united the sky. Oh, he got—he had the, the little the glasses shine there. 
How incredibly anime of him. Oh, he's powered up. What fun is a death match if my opponents are already dead? I suppose that's fair. This is the moment of truth. Do not falter. I don't plan on it. Whatsoever you decide, we will follow your lead. Yeah, what the hell? We should have brought her along with us. Okay, so what? <laughs> Those folks are betting their lives out there. I think you're also pretty Except fine as far as uh, money goes, folks. Are we are we getting a spirit bomb right now? Like, what's all these this blue glow around everyone? It's the same glow as the link between the captain and Lyria. Oh, we are we are actually getting spirit bombs right now. This is wonderful. Share your energy with me, folks. Our bonds are stronger than ever. We shall prevail. I guess it's a is it a, is it a actual physical thing in in this uh, universe? Like I thought maybe our link with Lyria was special, but it seems like like literally bonds can power you up in in a very literal way, right? Okay, okay. Calm down, you weirdo. Again, I heard. Look, I don't, I don't like looking at her face. He is uh, very ugly. I'll, I'll say that. Could be nice. All right, let's get all these big boys out of the way, and then hopefully that should open up a little dimensional portal for us to beat her ass. There you go. I don't even need the link. There's one more, isn't there? Oh no, it's just two. Oh no, there is one more. He's over there. Uh, can we get him in time? I think so. No, not if I mess it up like that, though. Oops. What a time to be alive. Oh, baby. I thought I could get a, a hit on those hands, but they moved out of the way just in time. Is there a wormhole to, do, to deal with here? Okay, yeah, Galanza's still insane, but, you know, it's good. Crazy on your side can often be a very useful thing. Oh, there's the wormhole. Perfect. I've been waiting for this one. Isn't it beautiful, Lilith? This is the power of emotion. The undying life. Is this the idea that sky do uh, astrals are kind of like emotionally deadened? So they can't access the same sort of bond power that humanity can, or sky dwellers at least? Somewhere along the way, we turned a light. We found a window into the darker emotions of the mortal mind. You pray on fear and desperation. He's giving a hell of a speech right now. I'm sorry, I'm just like, I, I want to listen to the roll and soul feel here. Oh god, oh god, I ran into the blight. That's what I'm saying. Ow. Dude, tell her. Oh my god. Uh, can I get out of here? Okay, I'm just keeping that as an option, because sometimes it feels like it's a better idea to just not be where the bad stuff is. Like, maybe right now. Like, maybe that maybe that's cowardly of me, but I felt like that one was not going to end well. But I, we also, we got our big hit on her already, right? Oh, no, I don't want Link time. Okay, okay, thank you, Ed. He messed up right when I needed him to. Wait, he's over here now? What's he doing over here? Wait, he's supposed to be in like a different dimension? Well, this isn't good. Uh, this seems fine. Well, maybe I don't want to be here though. Okay, he's just summoning hands. Oh, this is okay, yeah. The big attack that we have to interrupt eventually. Okay. I was very wrong earlier when I said standing behind the hands would maybe keep us safe. Got it. No, I got it. Makes a lot of sense. Just, just, just uh, give me a sec here, folks. I'll be right with you. Okay, now we have to interrupt all of this while they go help Rock'em. Don't mind if I do. One, a big one, and then a little one. We don't need Link time yet. We need it for uh, Angra Lilith over there. Perfect. And then hopefully this one, the one more here should break it. That's roughly how it seems to work for uh, Angra. No. Oh, we need to break more? Wait, do we need to break more? all of them? Now that it's... Hopefully all of the hands on one side will be enough. Wonderful. All right, this is the part where hopefully we can get a break and get some link time. But if not, I'll just skybound Art her as soon as he stands back up. The Reaper does await, and it's me. Bonk. 
There you go. Link time. And then while we're here, let's Skybound dart her. Make sure we get the most of this Link time. With some nice stun locks. Wonderful. It's doing his whole thing. I think it just said parts destroyed. I like guess the first time I've seen such, uh, like, this, that's the most Monster Hunter thing I've seen so far. Oh, we're out of Link time. I see. It ate up my, uh, my time, unfortunately, the Skybound art animation. I thought maybe it wouldn't. This is fine, though. We can still get a whole lot of, of damage here on this stupid lady. One big bonk for the roads. Oh, and it's a break. This is great. We're just chaining all of these statuses. One after the other. Based, Roland. Very based. Yeah, I don't think he's listening very much, though. But, I mean, she's already at 31. So she'll have to listen to us eventually, once we break her in half. Uh, we can't, unfortunately, interact with her right now. We have to wait for her to summon more of those little losers for us to break open. Oh! Right. Okay, yeah. But she can interact with us. Of course. Damn right. Let's get into this wormhole real quick. Where is it? I've lost my wormhole. This might be a good time for some immortal pain. What do you guys think? I feel like I'm a little scared of whatever's coming up next here. That's a big hand. That is a real big hand. Those, that is her eye color. That is weird and freaky. What are we doing here? Oh, they're making big guys. Is that, are those going to stay still? I hope these lasers are going to stay still. Okay, okay. We're safe. Distractions. I know, I know. It's fine. I'll take care of this one. There you go. Nice and easy, right? Oh, she's not even stunned, though? That's just like... Okay, wonderful. Hello. Oh, he's spectral mode. Any wormholes? No, no wormholes. Okay. I've learned my lesson. I'm going to be much more careful of uh, giant evil death lasers. Aka mana. Interesting. Can I just like smack you in the face? I guess so. That works pretty well. Oh god, I'm in the bad dodge. Woo! Woo! Okay, okay. A little bit of a panic maneuver there, but it worked out. Okay. okay. There you go. And there's our wormhole. Oh, baby. Light! That's cheating. Get over here so I can smack you in the face. Oh, we're getting unwormholed. Oh, perfect. No, no, no. This way. Yeah. Yeah. One of these. And another one of those. Are we going to get enough, enough time for a big charge here? Maybe. No, nope, no. Nope. I should have done just one. Okay. I could. I didn't uh, hard commit fast enough. Okay, okay. Well, maybe it's an opportunity to smack her in the head quite strongly there, but it's fine. Overdrive. I mean, she's being real honest right now. Good for her, I suppose. Okay, we're back here. These guys are doing their thing. We're gonna create more pillars. Oh, no, Prelude. Okay. I'm just gonna do this. I don't even care. I just don't want to deal with this attack. These lasers are a pain in my butt. And I see no reason to have to respect them. I don't... You, you, can, you can bounce me around all you want. I am totally fine with all of this. I am just doing whatever makes my life easiest right now. There you go. And now, just in time for last judgment, our Undying is still around. One of these. And one of those. There's Undying gone, but at this point, we're not going to take any damage for a little bit. I was gonna, I'm taking the big chunks off, and I'm letting them finish off what remains. That seems to be working pretty well as far as efficiency is concerned. There you go. And now we get over to her. Uh, let's do a big one. Yep. A big one. And then as soon as she gets up, we'll skybound dart her. Oh, well, link attack first. And then... Oh, no, I did the same thing again. I'm gonna waste all my link time. I'm a fool. Okay, okay, but it's still... The skybound dart is still better for the stun than the link time, honestly. I can, I can still get one hit in here with Link Time. Oh, it's already over. No, never mind. I thought maybe. But no, not quite. Nice. I mean, this one more should do it, and then the full burst. I think that's it, folks. I think we got her. 
GG, you big nerd. Oh, baby. It's just that easy, as it turns out. Good games. Uh, shake my hand. Oh, we're getting the main menu music again. Oh, she's absorbing her. I guess now that Lilith is part of Angramanyu, we can really get rid of her forever by just absorbing the primal through Lyria. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, she made herself more defeatable. Oh, no, no, she's still there. Interesting. I thought she would be gone along with the primal, but I suppose not. I see. As strong as you are, you can't do everything alone, man. And you were real strong. It's a kid boo problem. At a certain point, if literally everyone is against you, there's just no way for you to pull out. No matter how strong you are. Our sins are grave. Too great to measure. Don't you see? You were wrong to think of sacrificing this world and its people. Wait, is he also an astral? Oh. It's not too late. I thought it was an adopted sky dweller, maybe. Accept my fate. Are you gonna kill him? Please. Please. Okay, no. I'm sorry. Oh my god, he's actually calmed down. Alright. Wait. Maybe? I'm sorry. I think he's actually chilled out a little. I'm so scared she's gonna like stab him through the chest all of a sudden. But I think we finally truthful with you from the start. Maybe he finally beat all the fight out of out of her? Or is she gonna try and kill him now? Oh man. I tried. That's why I see. I, I was. I was still suspicious. Perhaps it's time we correct my deception. Oh God! He just broke a choker. Is he getting? Is he, is he gonna Broly? Yeah, he's gonna Broly. That was his limiter, I suppose. Claim thy divine right. The sky is once more yours to sunder and renew. This bitch doesn't give up, man. Primeval dragon, child of darkness and flames. <laughs> you can't. Oh god. Id the final boss. Thy name is Bahamut. Yeah, I knew I, I knew it was weird when he said Reagan Lave earlier. So what, he's Bahamut and we're proto-Bahamut? Is that how that works? I suppose so. God damn it, man. My handsome little boy. My handsome little boy. Wings and burn it all to ashes. Jesus. All right. Perhaps it will be the cycle. You will heed me. Make your mother proud! Time to fight Broly. You know how it goes. Do I get a kaiju battle or is this like a regular boss fight? Oh! This is the moaning we heard at the beginning. Oh, it was a child, not a woman? It was it. Well, I mean, that was somewhat clear last time, but the moaning was still weird. It it's sounded. Okay. Let well, me be the one to save you. Huh? Yeah, it's a that's a kid. It's a lot more obvious now that with all the extra context. Oh. What in God's name? Perhaps I acted in haste. So swiftly you sensed the dimensional distortion. Oh, meddlesome wings, you who defy the stars. So that's Angraman you on the right there. Who the hell is on the left? You will sleep within this child until I have further needed. Her. That's Bahamut. I see. Okay, I guess that makes it looks like him. So again, we are like the, the Bahamut that we summon is proto Bahamut, which I must much I must assume is a different thing. He sensed a dimensional distortion. Her trying to this is um He thanks that. Come, the stars await. And we mustn't keep them. Is Bahamut some kind of like dimensional policeman? Beginning stirs. Interesting. 
Okay, well, I mean, that just about confirms what we already knew. Bahamut is sealed inside id for some reason. Well, for the reason that he seemed to be getting in the way of whatever Lilith wanted to be using him for. Uh oh. Yep. My hands. Yep. What am I? It's okay, buddy. We'll beat you uh, back into Mother. shape. Don't worry. Yuria. Oh my god. Yep. That's Bahamut, all right. And so it begins. The final trial. Oh man. Isn't Bahamut like a, you know, maybe this Bahamut's also a good guy, like our Bahamut. Maybe he'll just immediately turn on Lilith. Okay. Does not seem to be the case, at least not right away. Oh. Yeah, actually. Go forth. Well, not that he was turning on her, but I guess he's just... For Utopia. He's just a force of nature, right? He has no sides. Really. And Lilith, so she lost... And she would really, she would rather just, she maharaga us. That's what she did, man. He would rather just everyone die. Oh, wait, no, he's still going to try and trigger the gates. Huh? What? You don't say. Wait, what? Okay. So, Lilith is dead right the die i mean it's hard to say uh, you know we didn't see a body i guess but you know it seems like at least he's not going to be a problem anymore but id ha is bahamut apparently and he's is he trying to head back to the astral realm or what exactly is he gone forever well final chapter okay well Looks like I got debated by the story Id yet again. Dragoned and vanished into the somber skies. Yeah. His roar, which echoed like a distant peal of thunder, electrified me with sadness. God damn it. Well, it's always got another trick up her sleeve, huh? Uh, can't believe it. I thought if we beat Angra Mainu, we'd be free to go on our merry way. <laughs> Exactly what I thought too, Wigan. No kidding. Why did it have to go off and become Bahamut? Wild sentence, by the way. Yeah, why did he have to go off and become Bahamut? So yeah, okay, but this is something that I still need some clarification on from you guys. So the Bahamut that's in Lyria's necklace is not Bahamut. Like, it has been a reference, even every time it's referenced, it's proto Bahamut. I don't know what that means though. So he's Bahamut. We're we have proto Bahamut. What's the difference? Are we fake? Are we real? Are we older? Is he older? Or I don't I have no idea. Right. Which case? Hey, what are you thinking about, Roland? It's good that you're back, at least. You've got all your gears if anyone's got a solution for whatever's going on, it's probably Roland. It's starting to come together now, especially if she used a mind sealer on him. Help us. The mind sealer is what they used to rob Lyria of her free will. Right. What does it have to do with Bahamut? Well, I guess the mind that was sealed in this case was Bahamut, maybe, and not it. Everything. Lilith and Bahamut. Destruction and rebirth. Everything is linked. I need you to be a little bit more clear, brother. I understand. I'm sure this makes a lot of sense to you right now, but I don't have quite as much context. How about giving us the gist? That, uh, in, in fewer words, what Vern just said. Essentially, it comes down to why Lilith failed to wake Angramainu 15 years ago. I mean, he's got a smile on his face, so I, I'm sure it could be worse then. I heard the Sky Realm's Bahamut appeared after sensing an overwhelming astral presence. Perhaps that was more than rumor. Right, so Bahamut stopped whatever she was trying to do last time, I suppose. You call that the gist? I'm even more confused. Uh, yeah, I could definitely still use a bit more detail. Sorry. Fifteen years ago, Lilith summoned Angra Mainu. At the same time, Bahamut manifested to face her. So far, so good. But this was not the same Bahamut you all know. Let us call it Bahamut Versa. Wait, so we are Bahamut. So even though we're proto-Bahamut, like, we are Bahamut. That's not the real Bahamut. I don't know, man. Sensed the unfathomable power of Angra Mainu and consumed it. That seems pretty pretty beast of him. Stopping Lilith in her tracks. But now, mm -hmm. perhaps, 
To remove Bahamut from the picture, Lilith trapped the primal inside it using the mind sealer. This part makes sense. Okay, but that doesn't explain why she suddenly freed Versa. Does she want to wreck the skies or what? This part doesn't make sense. Yeah, like that. Like, is it really just her being petty? And, well, you know, if I can't win, then you're all going to die anyway? She once told Id that she would destroy the world to bring about its rebirth. Versa is more than capable of forcing reincarnation upon the sky realm. I'm sorry, forcing reincarnation? Huh? In any case, we know one thing for sure. If we leave Versa to its own devices, it will be the end of all life as we know it. Okay, well, more, more world at stake. Uh, I mean, Great Scythe into dodge cancel into charged heavy attack? That's, that's my guess. I think so. I think we, yeah. I mean, if there's some way we can separate the two of them. Not gonna happen. Yeah. Thank you. He doesn't deserve death. Huh. Still got a debt to settle with that punk. Can't let him off so easily. I suppose not. How do you know it's still in there? Call it a hunch. Even Bahamut's, Even Bahamut's got Bahamut's nothing got on it. On it. Wonderful. Exactly. Guy with a stick that far up his butt, even an apocalyptic dragon couldn't push him down. I, you know, I like the way you phrase that, Oigan. Even if we can get through to him, he'll survive a beating. He trounced us, right? True. And we're pretty strong at this point. I've been around for a long time, but you sky dwellers never cease to surprise me. I never would have dreamed that a single crew could save Tempeel. Mm hmm Or pacify Excavalion. Keep going. We, uh, or defeat Angra Mainu. That's good. Give us the praise. We, we like it. But we like to hear it. You've taught me that it's not longevity or physical strength that's important. Okay, now hold on a minute. We got some... The power of your heart. Okay, fine, fine. Yes. I was like, we have some physical strength. But like, okay, sure, sure. Let's, let's let him keep his speech going. I believe that nothing in all the world... Will keep you from saving your friend. Oh, baby. Oh, look at us going into the dawn. Jesus. Yeah, I guess so. Um, well, I mean, that, the, the boss fight ended. So we're only 37 minutes in. I guess let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's try and, uh, and finish this off here if we can. This might be a little bit of a longer episode, but I mean, this may very well be the finale episode of the story, right? So why not? Let's say if this ends up being like an hour and a half or something, uh, I'm not going to complain. Let me very, very quickly get a little uh, mastery tune up going here. Uh, Skybound Dart deals more damage. Sure, I'll just go down this path. I'm not necessarily paying attention. That's fine. Just getting some 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 higher stats and you have a full party. Do you want to be, do you want to part anyway, a full party is advised for the big battle ahead. Well, you see, I used to have a full party. And then, well, yeah, it was there, and now he's not. Uh, sure, you know what, Catalina, you got replaced. Back into the fold. It's you and Lyria all the way. Oh god, I mean, let me let me, let me uh, drop a save real quick here. But yeah, fuck it, man. Let's keep going. Let's let's uh, let's let's plow ahead. Maybe we could finish this episode. All right, let's go. You heard the man. Is precious. I mean. Even the god of destruction can't bear to lose it. Bahamut, I guess? Our bodies might be mortal. Our hearts are infinite. Very Kingdom Heart. Though he's in a dark place right now. I hope Id doesn't lose sight of that. Even if he does, I'll open his eyes again. Awesome. I always thought it was cool. This crew will never abandon someone we care about. It's good that he's become such a big part of the story. The sunrise spills over the Grand Cipher as we rush on the winds. Chasing the sorrowful cries of a faraway dragon. He sure is fast, huh? Like, hopefully he settles down at some point, because otherwise I don't think we have much hope of actually catching up to him. Like, he, uh, he was really zooming when he, uh, when he left all the way back in the, the fight with Lilith there, so. Yes. Id, Fondam. Oh, hi, Charlotta. Rockham. And the community plaza of the Blooming Market, yes. There he is. Wow, he is really fast. He's just cruising. Hey, uh, big guy, could you? Oh, that's good. He's got stormtrooper aim, guys. We're fine. He, this is basically the broadside of a barn, and he has a very hard time hitting it. Let me help you. Oh, Roland's got nothing left in the tank. We're focusing our bond energy into him. 
Spirit Bomb once again. Thanks for the support. Raise your hands to the skies, guys. Roland needs your help. What in God's name? Oh my, he can do that? He can hold Bahamut in place, huh? The spell is perfect. What is this power scaling, man? I need to, I need to, we need to do some grand blue power scaling at some point here. It's very interesting. Ah, okay, yeah, but Bahamut's still got a little too much muscle, it looks like. Yeah, broke free. Almost, almost. It seems the binding is only half effective. Oh man. This about took himself out trying that. Captain, the rest is up to you. Half effective is still something. You can keep him in one place. You must save it. Okay. Let's go. Oh my god. We're standing on air. Oh boy. All right, let's do this. Gonna be hard to hit him in the head. Hopefully his foot is a weak spot, right guys? Bahamut Versa level 50, I see. Okay, hold on, this is, okay, okay, this is just Dark Souls. We just hit him in the, in the legs. Uh, the heart does not seem to be as weak as I expected it to be. Oh, no, no, actually, no. The heart is the best place to hit him. Perfect. Yeah, God, I love Vassaraga. Today we rage. Okay, okay, hold on. That's fine. Get over here. One of these. He's a cycle of reincarnation. I'm sure it'll be fine. Nice dodge. Good thing he doesn't have a hitbox on his ass there. We are actually fighting basically the incarnation of death, I suppose. Or even, even more so, the incarnation of, like, the concept of death, right? And the cycle of life and death. Okay, well, like, luckily, his weak spot ended up actually being quite easy to hit. So this is going well so far. And one of these. And one of these. Insert, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, vine boom sound effect. Oh. It doesn't seem good. Oh, okay. That's not bad. Oh, oh my god, we've got music. We got anime music. Oh my. I guess I, I needed to time my dodge a little earlier so that would, they wouldn't overlap like that. If I should fail to rescue you, I don't think I shall ever forgive myself for the rest of my long, long life. Don't need to worry about that, Roland. It'll be fun. It wasn't until you sky dwellers let me into your heart that I learned it was He isn't it right in front of him, does he? Doesn't seem so. You are capable of change and growth. Interesting. They can't change and grow. Huh? Oh, bloodthirst. What are you doing? I am also to blame for the failures of my people. Oh my god, this music. The person singing this sounds familiar. Oh. Like this this sounds like I've heard uh this individual before. The music goes super hard though. Just a little bit. I hope so. Oh, we'll, we'll buy you some time. I mean, honestly, you know, gods so far have not been above Great Sight's dodge heavy attack. Oh. Uh, objects in the mirror are further away than they appear. Say what now? Who now? Oh, I see. Okay. Well, uh, I, I hear you loud and clear. Hit him really hard in the chest. Okay, one more will do it, and we'll be far ahead of the bar, so that's perfect. Get the hell out of here with this. Oh, one more. What? Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Am I missing something? Oh my god, there you go. I just need to hit him even more. I was trying to look around for any other weak, spo uh, weak spots. Uh, yeah, yeah, don't mind if I do. Oh, oh, there she is. I was like, where are you? Hello, Lyria. 
There you go. Nice and easy, right? Hopefully. Yo, he really charges for a long time. Obliteration. Oh my god. Lyria can just do this, huh? Oh my god. And there he is. <laughs> Man, that is cool. That is cool. You gotta admit it. We got our own Bahamut, motherfucker. Oh. Okay, okay. Um, I guess we have to beat some sense into Id real quick. Yeah, something like that. Alright. Sorry, Id. Don't hold this against me. But I know you can take a couple lumps anyway, so you'll be fine. Does hitting him really hard help sever the, the spiritual shackles? That's kind of all I know how to do. Okay. Interesting. I missed. On the bright side, his health is going down a lot faster than Versa. Okay. Okay. Please get broken. Wonderful. Oh, baby. Here it comes. Okay. He is pretty awkward. Thank you for the revives, folks. The power of friendship. No, Id. Damn right. Oh, God. Yeah, this thing. It gets... The, okay, he keeps getting bigger, and then eventually it stops. One of these. Oh, man. Nice hit. I'll admit it. Okay... Weave in between there. Sit still for a second, man. Let me bonk you. It's for your own good. Yeah, we, we need to slow this guy. As much as we can. Also, are the two Bahamuts just fighting in the background right now? Oh my god, I think they are. Oh my god, they are. That's so cool. I'm so mad that I can't I can't watch this. Yeah, can I, well, I got a time, time to do this? Yes. Wonderful. All right. Sit down, it. We got a bigger dragon to take care of. I need you to I need you to roll over and die here. That's all the same to you. I think this will still hit. I think we're almost out of range, but not quite. Wonderful. Roll forward. Keep up with all the knockback from the skybound darts. One more. Perfect, and that'll do it. Awesome. Okay. Thank you, Itch. What? Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, uh, good thing I still have the slow. Okay, well, good thing I missed, apparently. Uh, you didn't get any tankier this time. Alright, I'll do it a second time. I knocked you on your ass once. Now I got link time to boot. Look, oh, uh, uh, just a nice, chunky 10% every time, huh? Ooh, even more if we get a crit. I'm gonna do this. Oh, I couldn't reach, uh, I couldn't do it quite in time, unfortunately. All right, big guy. How do you, uh, how do you feel about uh, getting bonked? That, that is like so many layers of filtering on that voice. Fractured it, I got you. Like the mental thing, you know, it, ego, super ego. I, I understand. There you go. Oh, that didn't work? I thought maybe that would work. Uh, can we hit him really, really hard? I thought maybe all we have to do is fill the break gauge. I think this will work. All we have to do is get him to zero, right? There you go. And then a couple of small ones to finish it off. Alright, well that's something. What the hell's going on? It? Oh. What, what the hell is the rage? You don't have to do that. Perfect. Okay, we're undying. Let's see if we can find a uh, good time to use this. I don't know what's happening. Oh, I can't hit him. He's a oh god. Oh, god. This is a bad time to use undying, possible. Well, maybe not actually. Maybe it was a great time to use undying. Because that attack had some serious bite to it. Hit. Hit. Oh my god, wonderful. Okay. 
believe anymore. Believe us. That works too. Oh. Please shatter. Wonderful. Okay. On to the next one. You guys do the talking, I'll do the bonking. I trust you to talk. Wonderful. That should do it. Oh, one more. Okay. Oh, even more. What the hell? This one's a lot tankier than the other ones. What's going on? Let him go. Okay, okay, perfect. What in oblivion is that? Oh, baby. Aid, please. To all of you. To to the skies. No way he just sunned him like that. Okay, okay, okay. Wonderful. That sounds good. Okay. I can get rid of Versa. You love to see it. We love the word closure. All right, the anime music's going. See how you like the taste of your own medicine. Your oh my god. Even though there's so much at stake, it's still strangely calm. It does. Yeah. This ain't our first, apocalyptic first apocalyptic rodeo. rodeo. That's right. That's right. You know what? I don't mean to get mustard. Let's let's do this. I'm really proud to be a part of this crew. I feel the same way. I won't let anything happen to you or our world. That's the plan. You gotta stop this. Wonderful. All right, get some big heavies in here. Let's not celebrate too soon, folks. We didn't get to the links, unfortunately, because I think people were in critical. But it's fine. This is where we're far ahead of this bar. So we can get him to 0% here with this next big bonk. That should do it. 52,000. That is definitely the biggest number I've seen out of us so far. 52,908. Ooh, the echo on the music there as everything faded away. Bring him out. I want my beam clash. Oh. He just blocked it with the sword? Oh, it's id, isn't it? Man, what a badass. I guess he is an astral, right? Otherwise, it doesn't make sense how strong he is. Wait, is he... The truth hurts. All that I've suppressed in the back of my mind. Damn it. I should have realized it sooner. No use running anymore. At least you got it now, man. I am who I am. Oh my god. How did you do that? How did I learn to do that? An evil dragon. Child of darkness and flame. Yep. My name is Bahamut. Bring him out. Ooh -hoo. I'm sorry I ever called you a bad guy, Bahamut. All the way back at episode one. I doubted you. I see the error of my ways. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love beam clashes so much. They just... They activate my neurons in a way that nothing else does. Let's go. I mean... Man. I'm sorry, I know I, said it, I say it every time this happens, but man, rest in peace, Toriyama, man. What a... What a horrible day for rain. But okay. Now are we... <laughs> it's, I, I've, been, I've been debated by the story Absolutely more than once. Absolutely amazing. You've suppressed Versus Core and driven it back to its home dimension. That's the good Bahamut, right? Thanks for everything. <laughs> You can buy me some apples on the way back. <laughs> We're still not done. Oh my god, please. No. What do you mean? What? Dude, nothing quits in this game. I respect it. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. The test of strength? 
What the hell are we supposed to do? I'm following you. Kid, what is he doing? You gonna jump in there? Oh, Bahama looks like he's winning. Our Bahama's winning. It's fun. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. We just needed the last anime double attack. Fair enough. What? Bro. Nothing can ever just go smoothly, can it? This stuff's cool, though, man. Again, all this anime. Like, I know it's... You know, it's it's pretty tropey, but like it's tropey for a reason. This stuff's good, man. It tickles tickles my brain. What the hell now? We're in the wrong dimension. Oh, we're really in the wrong dimension. Would have been great to have Voss here. So we're we're trapped in. The destruction realm with the destruction god. Oh, awesome! He can just rip through dimensions. It's a good thing we have an astral on our side. Great. Come on, come on. We don't have time for this, Id. There you go. Just come over here. Wonderful. Ugh. Yeah. Good thing we have uh, you know a literal demigod on our side. To get us out of that dimension. Wait, what are you doing? Don't worry, I'll be back soon. In like astral time? What? No, why? Soon, as in like a thousand years from now, but that's soon to you? Or is she just going to like deal with Bahamut? Or is I don't. Oh god, man, rolling. Nothing can ever go smoothly. <gasps> We're alive. Good. I was so worried. <laughs> Wait, where's it? What's the big idea? <laughs> Vern. Don't you ever do that again? How do you think we'd feel if you never came back, huh? This wasn't the intention to get dragged we into the astral realm. Fix it, dude. You'd be. Yeah, about that. Hello, Id. You look nice with the sun on you, instead of the dark. I never know it. Oiken has really nice eyes. Pets roll into you, oh my god. You okay, man? Where are you? His transceiver works cross-dimensionally? Good question. Someplace far away? Hey, this ain't the time for jokes. He and Bahamut are trapped on another plane. Think of it as a sliver between dimensions. Well, he, he cut through it once. Still, considering his transceiver seems to be working. For now. Sadly, I think my time's almost up. Man. The line's going to get cut earlier than I'd hoped. Thought I'd still be able to open a gate from here. Guess not. Oh man. Sure, just stay calm. No need to worry about little old me. Rollin. I'm Mr. Fix It, remember? There's no gem I can't get myself out of, you know. Oh, she said I like rolling a lot. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. I'll make it. I hope so. I mean he's he's just trapped, I guess. He doesn't seem to be like taking damage necessarily the longer he spends in there. There goes the signal. Man, I like trolling a lot. It's okay. You just gotta trust him, right? Surely he'll be fine. He's immortal. So, eventually, he'll figure out a way to make his way back there. That's where we bumped into Roland when we first arrived in the Sega Grande Sky Dungeon. Alright, he got jump scared by Vern in the church. I have to atone. Huh? What do you mean? For mother's crimes. 
And mine. You could move into Folka. Come on, no need to beat yourself up. Spend some time helping the people there. That's right. We couldn't have resolved this without you. True. That's some atonement right there. You saved the entire world. That that counts, I think. Call me crazy. Ed, you saved all of us. In my opinion, deep down, you knew you were fighting to help the skies. I'm sure of it. <laughs> this music's really nice, huh? So, it's not really about atonement. I know it's been tough recently. But I think the Sky Realm is better than it was before. Well, I mean, one less crazy, power-hungry astral around in Lilith. One less Angraman you to worry about. Let's visit Volka. Existential threats, definitely on the downturn. <laughs> one less Roland for now, though, which is definitely unfortunate. But one more id. Good. Which I think is definitely a good thing. Oh wait, don't let me off so easy. You all deserve an apology. Come on. <laughs> Cut the formality. God, I love Rockham. Said it was fine, right? <laughs> God, I love Rockham. You're one of us now. You got me. Nice. Sometimes he's got to adopt the introvert, you know? <laughs> Who's ready to set yeah. yeah, apparently it's just like, you know, it's one chapter. We still got to find the One Piece, man. We still got to get to Estelucia. Full speed ahead to beautiful Volga. Incredible. Oh, boy. That's a nice shot. That's a very nice shot. Oh. Of course, I'll never forget everything you've done. Never, ever. <laughs> Ever, 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 ever. And when we find Roland, we'll give him the thanks he deserves. I just hope he makes it out in, you know, the span of a human lifetime. We've met so many people in the Zegra Grande Sky. New friends. New allies. We saw a man torn in two by family and betrayal. We were saved by an immortal who found beauty in our changing world. Through loss and adversity, our resolve brought Lyria and I closer than ever before. Yet this story is far from over. Oh yeah. There's still the post game. Yeah, we got it. We got to get permanent weapons. <laughs> waiting for us to come get him. I do wonder, yeah, is there at any point? And as for our journey, there's still much to see. To the ends of the skies, where the stars reside. Someday, we will reach Estelucia. Nice. Nice. Little little credits sequence here. Yeah. Okay. Id. Complete the final chapter of the main story. I mean, as much as we we, we can uh, we can sit here and watch the credits for a little bit, I think. But you know, in general, I think this is this is, this was fun, right? I mean, we're still obviously this is not the end of Relink on the channel. It's the end of the story, right? So now we get to uh, you know this is. Originally, I did not play this. I didn't even know this story or this game had a story, right? I thought I was going to hop in and play Monster Hunter, you know, with uh, with Grand Blue characters. But honestly, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised, right? Like, I know the story, it's not the most subversive thing in the world. And some people, you know, that's really important to them, right? It is, at the end of the day, 
it's very tropey, right? It is it is very much an anime, you know, like a shonen anime type story, you know. Good guys, bad guys, redemption, fighting for friendship, bonds. I mean, literally, at some point, people use their bonds. Like, the power of friendship quite literally physically manifests and buffs people, right? But again, I'm not... I'm, I'm, uh, we talked about it in the story corner um, last last time or two times ago. I think two videos ago. Where, like, just because something is cliche or tropey doesn't mean that it's not valuable. It just means that it's an idea that resonates with a lot of people and was figured out that it resonates with a lot of people a really long time ago. Right? And as people just keep repeating it, because it's a good idea, it makes sense. So Stuff like the power of friendship and the idea, again, it's, uh, it's the Kid Boo thing with Lilith, right? Where it's like, he's so incredibly powerful. Almost! She can do it by herself. But at the end of the day, you know, a thousand people working together are always going to get farther than one person doing it alone, no matter how much more capable or any quality that that one person possesses. So that's like a really interesting... There's lots of stuff like that that's very interesting, but... I like the story. Overall, I think I enjoyed the story uh, quite a bit. I like a lot of the characters, right? I was already kind of pre-set up to like a lot of these characters, but like... Rockham isn't in Rising, for example. Roland isn't in Rising, and those are probably my two favorite characters, right? I think they did a really good job of making everyone, uh, you know, super likable. Like, I actually got sad when Roland was, like, stuck in the, uh, in the void there. I'm like, I'm sad, man. Like, I hope there's, like, some, at some point in the post-game, there's some side quest or something about freeing him, hopefully. But we'll, uh, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. Um, for now, I suppose, I mean, good, uh, obviously credits are often skipped, but it's just, it is important to realize that, you know, just look at how many people it takes to make a video game. Isn't this, isn't this absolutely nuts? Like, we're... Oh! It's, it's in English now. Like, we're, we're fast-forwarding through all this, and just look at how many goddamn people there are. And like, there's probably gonna... I mean, we're not even gonna get to the end of this. I'm gonna skip pretty soon here. But, like, well done to everyone who worked on that. I think this game... I mentioned it... Uh, sorry, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna skip, um, because I, I wanna... You know, we, we do wanna have some time for our, our story corner here. But I mentioned it earlier, where so many little things in this game... Okay, I'll... We'll finish this talk in a second, Vern, but... Uh, so many little things in this game were just, like... You could tell... I, I was mentioning a lot more in the earlier episodes, too, right? Things like, we got a new portrait for the captain when he got the new armor. Uh, people, when they... Like, the little portraits that pop up in the middle of missions, people are talking. They have multiple different poses and facial expressions and things like that for the character, depending on what they're saying, right? Lots of little things like that um, that are just... Like, the, uh, the, the, the wish list... For, and it's not see not just an art sense, right? Like the wish list to find items that you need, things like that. Lots of little touches like that that just show you this is a high quality game, right? The people who made this game really cared about this game being good, and that's kind of an unfortunate rarity in video games, right? Not to say that. Sorry, let me let me walk that back for a second. Like even even in games that have a bit, you know, they're a bit more maligned. Maybe they weren't released functional or any any even more controversial games. I'm sure like a lot of the people who were working on it really cared about what they were working on and were passionate about what they were doing. But, like, the overall product, somewhere along the way, someone higher up most of the time, that, that care wasn't really present, and, you know, the link breaks and the end product doesn't end up being as good as you might want it to be. But it seems like pretty much everywhere along the way in this game, people cared. And you can definitely see, I, I really think this is a high-quality game, it's a high-quality story. Mechanically, artistically, narratively, I'm, I'm a big fan of everything. Uh, well, they'll be getting into the post-game in later episodes here, but for now, let's see what Vern and everyone else has to say. I think we should start by finding Roland's house. Interesting. If memory serves, he was living at the church. But why the sudden interest? Oh, he keeps his dimensional pocket knife that he can use to cut out of planes there. I just remembered. The church. Got it. Okay, doesn't answer our question. Fair enough. A man of few words. Now, new stickers and character colors. Colors can be changed via character details. You can lock the ability to fast travel. Wonderful. Didn't even answer you. Interesting. I guess we still need to work on his people skills. Well, Wait. We know where he went. We should go see what he's thinking. All right, let's let's do the epilogue. I suppose we're missing. We're not we're not done quite yet. We might not do story corner this time, but I mean, you guys got you got a lot. This is a very story packed episode anyway, right? So it's fine. Yeah, let's. This will be consider this epilogue our story corner here for the last ten minutes. What's it up to? Found him. What you doing here, Ed? Exactly. I have the same question. Looking for a way to save Roland. That's fair. This place is replete with his memory. We really appreciate it, Ed. You chipping in to rescue Roland. I mean, he saved Ed, too, right? It's not even just him helping us at this I point. I him just as much as you do. Exactly. Exactly. More, even. I feel bad intruding on his home without permission, but there might be clues around. 
want to help us search? Oh, I guess I'll, I guess I won't be able to ask Roland uh, if we could read his journal for a little bit. I just realized. Hello there. Oh, caring man. You mention Roland. We we talked to you all the way back in chapter one. Oh huh? uh, yeah, you a friend of his too? You don't remember caring man? Come on, Rockham, where are your manners? So my ears didn't deceive me. We've met before, remember? At the docks of Tempeel. I remember a caring man. Okay. Oh, you're the guy that told us about hallowed ground. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. He was the guy who introduced bonfires to us, the wasn't he? Same. But um back to yeah. Would you happen to know where he is? I can't uh, touch. Difficult question to answer. Would a plane between dimensions that like be satisfactory to? Oh, he's he's um Dude, when you say it like that it makes it sound like he's dead. Uh uh let's say somewhere let's 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 use Roland's same line. Somewhere far away. Yeah, really far. It'll probably take him a while to get back. That's fine. I just wanted to be sure he was safe. Knowing Roland? He'll probably wander in through that door when we need him most. The trust people have in him is, is really telling, right? So, of his character. I hope that's sooner rather than later. Me too, buddy. Why is that? Something wrong? Well, as you may know, in addition to being a vicar, Roland was the local Mr. Fixit. And I'm not just talking with hair. Monster hunting, herb picking, he was a real lifesaver. But now that Roland's gone, there's tons of work that's going unfinished. Side quests, you mean? How interesting. I'll do it. It no, I want the XP. Huh? I'll take up his mantle. You're just as personable and friendly, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure that'll go great. Ah, this is so painful to watch. Will somebody please teach this kid to speak like a normal person? Ah, thank you, Rockham. I think Id meant to say he just wants to be helpful now that Roland's gone. Right, Id? Say yes. Right. Yes. Wonderful. Oh. Well, that's very kind of you, but, um, how do I put this? You are big and scary, and the community is going to have a hard time putting trust in you until you learn to smile for once. We were comfortable asking Roland for favors because we trusted him. While you certainly look like an upstanding young man, <laughs> he sees you're still a stranger. No offense. Well, you gotta give him a chance to earn your trust. But, I... There, yeah, there you go. We'll help out too. You trust us, right? We we've we've helped out a lot. Great idea. Hey, Mister, we aren't strangers. What have we tagged along? Side quests. Well, all right, if you insist. I have to say though, you've done so much for our city. I feel guilty piling more work up. As long as you give me refinium, griffin feathers, mastery points, Rafaeli coin, land beast claws, I'm sure we'll be just fine. You sure about this, Captain? Hey, you called me Captain. Yeah, no, let's not even say it's what Roland would want. Let's, let's, I'm welcoming you. I want no you here. Problem. The more the merrier. For sure. There's no way we'd let you pick up the slack all by yourself. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, now that everything's settled. Goddamn coup de To the crew alliance for fall. Yes. Whenever you feel like taking something on, head over to the quest counter. Thank you again. And best of luck. And there's our narrative setup for Monster Hunter with Grand Blue characters. You love to see it. It has joined the party. Wow. So we can actually just play. So we can just play as Id forever, huh? Like he's just a. Like we, I could be an Id main, hypothetically. He seems cool, but unfortunately, he's a little uh, a little small. He's not quite Vasaraga. Speak with the caring man. Wow, are we not done? It's gonna it's gonna be like if it's gonna take us on like our first side quest or something, then then that that'll be. You know, this is like the beginning of the the post game, as it were. Then uh, we'll we'll cut it here. But I suppose, you know, since we're not doing story corn, we have a little bit more time to kill. So let's let's talk to him and see what's up. Hello, caring man. Hey, it's everyone's favorite crew. Perfect timing as usual. Truth is, I just put out an urgent cry for help. We got a caravan strong armed by goblins in Skyworm Valley. Goblins We're looking for folks to beat off the half beasts and retrieve the stolen goods. Well, that's a little bit. It's like we're back to fighting slimes and rats after we just killed God. Might be a tough battle, but think you can head out now? I think we'll be fine. Uh, no. <laughs> no. I'm sorry. Preparation's the key to success. Yeah, yeah. Just give me a hollow. Sorry, sorry, caring man. Okay, okay. So I suppose this looks like, ba like I'm, at this point, it's not story, really, right? It is going to just be 
doing a, a bunch of side quests and whatnot, but it's still... Like, I expected that eventually all of it will just transition over to the quest counter here. But I guess we still have a couple of sort of epilogue-style story quests to uh, to get over with, but... I mean, yeah, uh, for all intents and purposes, that's uh, that's the story of Grand Blue Fantasy Relink, I think. And again, I had a, had a really great time. It took us, what, something like... Uh, this is something like 10 hours or 11 hours or so to get through? Not bad. And again, I've heard that there's... You know, let's say a lot more than 11 hours of content left in the video game. So there's still a lot of reeling to play and a lot of fun to have. Uh, but yeah, we're not doing Story Corner this time around. Because again, this has basically just been one long Story Corner this episode. It's been cutscene after cutscene. So uh, I hope you guys forgive me. We'll pick it up uh, in the next episodes. But you know, we went a little long. For now though, as always, for everyone, uh, if you made it this far in the video, I got four things for you. You know how it is. For number one, uh, join the Discord server. It's a fun time. Links in the description. You can uh, join and talk about... Fighting games, talk about Relink, talk about gacha games, talk about whatever games you really talk about TV shows and, and, and certain channels, right? Whatever you feel like. It's a whole bunch of very nice and welcoming people there, so I implore you to join. But if you do, make sure you keep it a nice and welcoming place. I haven't had to really, like, moderate anyone at all, but I will not hesitate to drop the ban hammer on somebody if I have to. So just don't make that be you. Don't be the first person I ever ban. That's not a reputation you want to have. Number two, if you liked the video, and I sure hope you did, get down there and like the damn video, man. Come on, it's free. It don't cost you nothing. Greatly upset the channel, and I appreciate it a lot. I appreciate all your guys' support on the Relink videos. I know it's a different style of content from what a lot of the people who first found my channel, you know, what, what they came here for. But, you know, a good bit of you have still been supporting these episodes, and I appreciate it. Um, for number three, while you're down there, that subscribe button, that bell button, they're right over there. And uh, they'll keep you up to date with all of this content we're throwing at you. we got a lot more Relink coming every day at 7 p.m. here, the post game, and all of the grinding that I'm no doubt sure we will be doing. Uh, so want to stay up with that, you hit those two buttons there. As long as noon p.m., as, as well as, rather, noon p.m. EST, we got fighting game-related content. Grand Blue right now. Maybe it'll be, you know, it'll change up slightly as time goes on. So, interested in that, keep up with that, too. And, of course, for number four, look at this little kid here, swinging the sword around. What a cutie. Uh, uh, for number four, more important than whatever algorithm-friendly interactions you hit or whatever buttons you smash or anything like that. Uh, I hope you had a great time hanging out today, as always. I know I sure did, right? Again, I this is this was nice to get the sort of end of the main storyline here. I think it's, it's a game's a lot of fun. The story was very touching. Uh, I enjoyed a lot of the. I, I love a lot of the characters. Right. Glad to have Id back. Hopefully we can get Roland back at some point. But otherwise, having a lot of fun with Relink. It's gonna be a lot more coming your way. And until then, I will see you in the next one. Peace.